Hi, I'm Carrie with BTOD.com. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing and first impressions of the Herman Miller Lino. If you like this content, let us know by subscribing to our YouTube channel and don't forget to follow us on our other social medias for more behind the scene content and giveaways. This is how your chair will arrive if you buy it directly from Herman Miller. It does weigh about 50 pounds and has helpful handles on the side, but you may need somebody to help you carry it. Let's get into this unboxing. First impressions, seat is a lot more stiffer than I imagined it. The old line. Looks nice. Looks like a typical Herman Miller chair. Nice sleek mechanism. I like the base. Plastic, but it still looks good. Fairly firm seats. First sit. It's definitely, uh, like others have said, I, I, looking at it, I thought I would sink into the chair much more, but I just kind of, you know, you just kind of hit it. It looks really nice. I really enjoy this color scheme. This looks like it would be really fuzzy, but it's not. Initial sit. Padded Herman Miller seat, the rarity. Ooh, okay. It's like the uh, Series 2. It's like thick, and you expect it to be cush, and then it's just dud. So, I would have to sit in this chair for a while to see how much I would like it. It does go low enough, but I'm 5'2", and I am wearing probably a one inch heel right now, and if I was wearing flat shoes, it would probably be a tad too tall for me. So I'm about 6'1", six, 6'2", six, and surprisingly, I don't even need to put it up at the top, which is nice. The seat isn't like uncomfortable. It doesn't feel the way that it looks, if that makes sense. It's kind of thick and cushy, but it doesn't feel like this. It does provide good support, though. You can feel that it's definitely not going to bottom out. So the seat is really thick, but it also doesn't seem like I'm like gonna bottom out. Like it seems like a good quality, thick cushion that's also supportive. Backrest is super comfortable though. I'm interested in the lumbar back here. It's it's actually it's pretty comfortable. I, when I adjusted it to myself, I think the backrest hits in a nice spot and the recline is really smooth. This backrest. Reminds me kind of of the uh, Vera, really sink into it. I like it. The lumbar hits me, it's like barely getting on my back. I almost feel like it's kind of, could definitely go much higher. It's nice, I mean, you can definitely feel it. It does make a difference. Back's really comfortable. Interesting lumbar. Doesn't stretch the whole back, but Firm in the middle of the back on the lumbar support. So the lock is on this side. The lock. That's one. Two. Three. Five. So I've spent a lot of time in Herbert Miller chairs, and the reason is that I love the recline. So let's see. I mean, it's not an Aeron. It is pretty comfortable. It's a nice recline. Multiple positions. Nice. Is that what that is? Oh God. <laughs> yep, that's what that is. I do like the adjustability of the recline tension. I feel like a lot of chairs, you really have to crank on them to know if you're getting them to be loosened or tightened, and this just is, it just kind of clicks into place. 
the highest tension is way more tense than the, than the least, and you can adjust it super fast. A couple of seconds, you can go from the most to the least. It's actually really cool. I've never seen a tension like that. That's really nice, actually. You kind of sink into it nice. You don't feel the frame unless you really try to get out. So it feels like a nice chair you can kind of move around in if you want to sit kind of different positions, you know, it's like you, know, you can kind of relax in it and still be comfortable. greatest arms for sure, but it's also for the uh, cheaper chair from Herman Miller, it's kind of what you'd expect. They kind of stay where you put them though, which is nice, like they don't necessarily slide around, which I like. Depth, width, height, height. Good arms. I like that the uh, arms are rounded. They're not as uh, stout as like the arms on the Mira or the Aeron. They're still pretty nice. Definitely an upgrade to any type of import chair. Gives me good support. The back is high enough for me. I like it. It's good. Overall, a comfortable chair. I give it a thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, I like it. It's a really nice looking chair too. Kind of a nice shaped back. I don't know. I like this chair, actually. It's one of the least expensive chairs from them, right? I know it is for sure. Right up there with in comfort, there with the air on the body, just from a short term sit. So, same with fan. Initial initial impressions. I like the Herman Miller lineup. And that was the unboxing and first impressions of the Herman Miller lineup. If you like this content, let us know by subscribing to our YouTube channel, and don't forget to follow us on our other social medias for more giveaways and behind the scene content. Thanks for watching.